What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the MMA Ticket. Today I got a little different video for you guys. I got a extensive mail day. Uh, shout out to Cloudsy420. You guys can check him out. Uh, he's been very helpful with me here. Um, and uh, this is kind of like an idea. Kind of got a little inspired by him. But uh, all my mail has just kind of just been piling up. And uh, you know... I just didn't know what to do with it besides make a video. And then also, I have something very special here. This is also something I got in the mail. Um, and uh, I, I just already know what it is based off the packaging um, and where it said it was shipped from. But uh, stay tuned to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys. Uh, I'm going to be actually giving away uh, pretty much most of my personal collection. Um... I don't have much, but at the same time, I do have a, what I do have is pretty good. Um, and I just keep getting more in, so that is why I'm just kind of flushing out a lot, and I'm keeping what I need to. Um, so with that being said, I do have plenty, as I said, of mail here. And then with this in back. So, let's see what we got. All right. I've been getting into uh, the brakes a little bit, so that is where most of these are coming from. Nothing else in that one. So if you don't know how a brake works, um, depending on what type of brake you buy into, you could buy into fighter brakes, which is what I've been buying into. You could buy into weight class brakes, etc. Um, and pretty much you just, you bid on some body or some weight class and, um, whatever you get inside the box, whoever you paid for, that is every card that you end up getting. So with that being said, and this is a little high up there, right? Alright, bear with me, it's a little tough with the gloves, wait a second. Okay. So this here looks like I got... Oh. So far, you can see I got T-City, Brian Ortega. And I also have Darren Till. So let's see. These are out of the UFC 2021 UFC Select. So we got Darren Till, as I said. So it's a bunch of his base cards. Here we have Derek Lewis. Base card. Amanda Nunez. Oh, nice. Here we go. This is the, um, the premier level there. These sideway variants, these are called the premier level. And then you got the, uh, the vertical one here. These are called the concourse. Pretty sweet cards. I love them. Amanda Nunez losing to Juliana Pena, huh? That's crazy. I didn't really see that coming up, but uh, I guess that's why that was the biggest upset in uh, UFC history. So, <laughs> with that being said, let's see what else we got here. More T-City Brian Ortega. Base cards. Dominic Cruz. Here we go with the premier level. Oh, nice. Here we go. If you guys don't know about this man, you should. Bryce Mitchell, rookie card. Thug Nasty. And then here we go. That was a premier level, by the way. 
and then you got his concourse. Sweet deal, yeah. Oh man, it, it's like exciting even when you when you end up winning the the fighter that you uh, especially like a guy like this guy. Um, you know, it's just you 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 get some jitters inside. <laughs> so, and then now we have this is a blue numbered out of ninety nine T City. 73 of 99, Brian Ortega. This is a con, this is the, uh, yeah, the concourse disco, blue disco here from T City, Brian Ortega. Nice, beautiful card. And then we also have nice, the premier level, Darren Till. Beautiful blue disco. This is 14 of 99. Beautiful card. Next up, we have the Derek Lewis Silver. I'm trying to see if I can get a good one there. There you go. Derek Lewis Silver and Nice Silver Concourse. This UFC Select product. What do you guys think of this? This is nice, huh? This is beautiful. I, I just love the way the cards look. Like it doesn't even matter if it's a base card or not. And just beautiful. Oh nice. Here we go with the premier level disco for Derek Lewis. Nice. Yeah, so these are just these are just beautiful cards. And then next we have the silver also. Oops, sorry. There we go. Compare it like that. The silver to the disco. Nice. Next up, nice. We have the Amanda Nunes. This is the um, octagon side, yeah. Amanda Nunes base octagon side. And then we have the Darren Till Silver. Nice. That was that was an awesome little little hitter, you know. So let's see what else we got here. Oh, looks like it got me some Edgar. Frankie, the answer, Edgar. I feel bad. He's just been down on his luck recently. I, he's just—he's such a solid fighter, but uh, man. But here we go, Frankie Edgar, base. Another Frankie Edgar base. Uh oh, here we go. Oh, Frankie Edgar base, and a Rose Namajunas base. All right, that's all we had out of that. Some of these were just little, uh, just didn't want to break the bank, spend an arm and a leg over them. Sometimes some of these fighters really just get, uh, they get pricey and out of hand. And man, you better be able to control your bank account. <laughs> all right, let's see. Oop. You know, this is a, like a live uh, <laughs> mail break, pretty much. Mail day for me, that's how I'm just doing these videos. I just cut open the packaging first, and that's how it is. All right, so here we go. Trying to hit Mike Perry. I don't know why, I just really love him. Mike Perry, base prism. 
Another Mike Perry base prism. Dan Hooker. Nice. Here we go. I, I love Dan Hooker too. He's just he's just a nice solid dude. Uh you could also see him on Pub Talk. I don't know if you guys watched that, but solid character, solid dude. There you go, Dan Hooker base. And here we go with Jeremy Stevens. Little Heathen Stevens. And Dan the Hangman Hooker, that was before. So some of you guys, man, get your knowledge on these fighters. And then here we go. What do we got? A 41 of 75. And I already know this is a neon green because I already have one from before. <laughs> Look at that. Neon green Jeremy Stevens. Nice. The prism. So here we go with that. And there we go. All the time with the technical difficulties. All right, back in action. All right. Let's see, what do we got next? What do we have next? Well, let's see. Coming with the colored heat in my mail day, huh? Most of the time, it does end up being those base cards, too. And let me tell you, that's... I don't know what these are going to be because I'm doing it live for you guys, but... Alright, here we go. We have a blue prism for Jared Cannoneer. The Killer Gorilla. 143 of 199. Next we have Gokan Saki. Nice red parallel. This is numbered 271 of 275. For Gokan Saki. And we got Jared Cannonier base. And then we have Gokan Saki base. And then next, what is this? 20 of 149 for Gokan Saki, the purple prism. Nice. There you go. For Gokan Saki. And Jared Cannonier. Okay. Whatever. More Derek Lewis. <laughs> How about the Black Beast? Getting it done. Okay, here we go. We got the Strikers uh, parallel for select. Derek Lewis. Nice. This is a beautiful card, too. Nice Derek Lewis. And next is just the base for Derek Lewis. Okay. A few more here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoa, that was quick. Whoops. <laughs> Look at that. All right. We have a PSA graded Bloodlines. For KN, 
what year? 2013. Bloodlines for Habib Nurmagomedov. PSA 9. Habib Nurmagomedov bloodlines. How about that? Look at that. Beautiful card. PSA 9 graded already, huh? Don't even got to put in the work. Sweet deal. If you don't know, do your research. All right, what else we got here? Let's see. <laughs> well, I got this uh, little paper here. Uh, pretty much it says nobody likes getting skunked. And uh, here is some cards that may not be in your product but they still might be worth it so let's see what we got guys looks like we got our willie mays from the san francisco giants outfielder what is it what is that that's yeah, crazy what what year is this this is 1996 nice look at that these will, these are gonna go in their own little special pile. Uh, oh my God! Look at this. <laughs> Looks like I actually have an on-card auto here. This is this is crazy. Of Alexei Zetnik. Sorry for anybody <laughs> that I just butchered his name, probably. But wait, hold on. Looks like there's two in there. Oh, look at that. Nice. Here we go. Two on-card autos. There we go. Oh, <laughs> hold on a minute. Hold on, hold on. Let's see what we got here. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. <laughs> Three on-card autos for Alexi. Zip Nick. We'll go with that one. That one that one sounded better. Um if you guys would like these cards, let me know. Um and we could arrange for something to happen. So <laughs> don't worry guys, I will also do my research on that, see what that is about. And also we have a Ryan Smith. And I have zero clue anything about hockey so I probably should get on it but this is in 1995 Pinnacle Ryan Smith this is a beautiful card hmm. alright well that's that's that sorry to uh, stem away from the UFC product here so let's see All right. Nice. We have the Wonder Boy knockout artist. Poor Wonder Boy. I lost to Bilal Muhammad. Not that it's that bad that he lost to Bilal Muhammad. But it's just, uh, where does Wonder Boy go from here? Nice card. And we have the Wonder Boy base. Then we have the Calvin Gaslam's base. All right. Here we go. Oh, I know who this is from here.
this guy's also. This here is from Macy Collectibles. You guys can go find him on YouTube as well. Along with Cloudsy420. Let's see. This was out of a bounty hit out of the trivia that I won. Ended up hitting the mini bounty on his channel. And here we go. All right. First off, uh, oh, let's not start with that. <laughs> the fire right off the bat. Nice. We have the global icons for Blonde Vlahovic. Uh, I said Blonde Vlahovic? Jan Vlahovic. Jesus, Lord. Do my research. Nice, beautiful card for Jan Blahovic. Next, I just have a Holly Home base prism. Next, we have a Tops Now UFC 202 Conor McGregor versus Nate Diaz. Nice. That's a nice card right there. 2016 Tops Now for Conor McGregor. Nate Diaz. That is such a beautiful card, too. Just a shot on that. And last we have... Wow. Look at this, huh? Gold. Paul Felder. Out of select. Look at this. Octagon side 6 of 10 for Paul Felder. He's been doing a good job commentating recently, too. Uh, I just like all these fighters really uh, just getting down to it there. All right. And last, guys, we have the last little bit of the mail today. Now, this is something that I, I definitely uh, special ordered. Um, but uh, if you guys also find the link. You could also go to his uh, website that he has on this. He's, it's on Facebook, so that's how I got a hold of this. But uh, with that being said, I donated to this fighter's charity that he has set up with these people. And here we go. Stay spicy. Wow, look at that, huh? Wow, even an autographed Yep, it is it is autographed by Dustin Poirier. I could Yeah, it's it's on there for sure. It's not a a fake. It's like a green Sharpie you can see he wrote it with. Nice. Dustin Poirier, he signs these personally like these stickers at least, you know what I mean? And, uh, wow, let's, let's see, this is called the, uh, the limited edition, the, this is like the champion's signature, I, some, sorry, that's KO edition hot sauce, the gold label, look at that, huh? Justin Poirier's hot sauce. Go find it. Uh, yeah, look at that, Dustin Poirier. You can go find it here on this heatonist.com, and you will get a free autographed. Well, at least I did. <laughs> you will get a free autographed Dustin the Diamond Poirier sticker. So, I mean, if that doesn't kind of kick this all off, and if my mail day was bad, then you guys let me know. Because I almost don't feel like it is. And, by the way, this is collector's uh, 
I'm gonna keep in this, you know, just like that. God, you just see that dink. Sometimes I can't wish it all perfectly. But, nice. Well, let's see what we got. We have this Bloodlines PSA 9 graded already. Habib Nurmagomedov. And we have this gold. Oh, let's see. So I'm just floating through all these. And whatever cards, if you guys uh, would like these, let me know. Uh, and I will definitely get these to you sorry guys just give me one second here okay Saki down here. Mm. All right. Well, looks like that'll kind of do it here, guys. Stay tuned for the uh, next video, and uh, more fire is on the way for sure. Guaranteed. Alright, have a good day, guys.